Welcome everyone. Today we will learn how to populate a grid view with data from the database using ASP.NET C Sharp Entity Framework and link to SQL. We have created a table in the SQL Server database with sample data. Created an ASP.NET Web Forms project in the Visual Studio. Add a web form to the project. Add a grid view control to the web form. Link Bootstrap CSS for styling. Set the layout of the page using Bootstrap classes. We will display the country name and its capital in the grid view. Add columns to the grid view. Select bound field as field type. Type the header text. The data field name must be the same as the DB table column. Make the field read only. Style the grid view. Make a connection to the SQL Server database. Add an ADO.NET Entity Data Model to the project.
open the code behind file. In the page load method, write code to fetch data from DB using entity framework and link. Bind the grid with the fetch data. Test the results in the web browser. The data has been populated including the unwanted fields of the DB table. Set the auto-generated column property of the grid view to false. Refresh the results. Finally, the grid view shows only the required data.